So I am currently 14 days post surgical from a two level disc replacement. My neck, everything's going pretty good. I think one of the things I forgot to talk about in the past that I noticed is when I had the problem, my right arm would be, shoulder girdle would be super tight. When you reach up, if this is your scat bar, your shoulder blade, which is sitting on your back, in order to reach up, it has to swing out for you to reach up high. Well, the top portion of scapula on the side towards the spine has to go downward a little bit. When your neck is hurt and your traps are super tight, it wasn't letting the scapula swing properly. It made it very difficult to reach overhead. Combine that with a shoulder that's weak and it made it very difficult to reach overhead, even just to like scratch my back or like comb my hair. And I'm noticing that that has calmed down. So the muscles are much looser and relaxed. So that's a good sign. As far as changes, uh, not much. Uh, the suture site looks pretty good. It's drying up a little bit, so I'm still keeping it covered because I'm going to work. I don't, it looks kind of nasty underneath. Um, today starts the 14-day post-surgical mark. So what I'm doing, what you just saw me do, and I'm going to do it again, is I'm doing isometric contraction holds with a band against my neck. I'm not moving my neck at all. I'm just holding the position. And you can, based on how far back you push into this band, you can modulate the resistance. So that's what I'll be doing for the next week just to keep the neck muscles activated. I'm also doing some gentle uh, shoulder mobil mobilization techniques. Uh, overall, I think everything's going pretty good. Um, there is a little bit of fatigue still from the surgery, noticing that. Um, and I'm doing some walking still on the treadmill and or a step mill every day or at least four or five times a week for about 20 to 30 minutes. Um, I'm seeing the doctor tomorrow, the surgeon tomorrow, Dr. K with Atlantic Spine. Uh, I guess I'll report back after that, see if he has any recommendations or anything else. But we're following a PT script that we used for other people with multiple, multiple disc level replacements. So this is one of the first things we do for the neck, uh, just to actively engage the muscles.